Subject, revolution. Hi guys, Comrade Lennon here. Just a quick reminder that it's revolution time again, the 25th of next month. So uh, you should all have this information already. But just to recap, we're meeting at 9.45 by the battleship Aurora in Petrograd, then going on to the Winter Palace later. Bring banners, but no guns, and 20 rubles for the kitty. Uh, look forward to seeing you all there, Vlad. Gregory Zinoviev is out of office until Monday. Re-revolution, that's great, comrade. Really looking forward to it. Got a couple of work issues early on, so I might have to skip the Aurora part and swing by to meet you at the Winter Palace. Hope that's OK. And Mikhail, um, no, sorry, that's not OK. We all have to do it together. It's a show of strength and solidarity, plus we confirmed the numbers weeks ago. Gregory Zinoviev is out of office until Monday. <laughs> Hi guys, uh, not to worry, as it happens, I've got an early one the next morning, so probably going to drop out before the Winter Palace, so Mick and I can tag team it. All best, Alexei. So Mick and I can tag team it? Ooh, uh, didn't know it was going to be that kind of a night. <laughs> Trotsky, don't. <laughs> Alexei, Mikhail, we really do need everyone there for the whole thing, as arranged. Gregory Zinoviev is out of office until Monday. Hi, Comrade Lennon, just to clarify, are you sure you mean next month, October? Only I had it down as November. Cheers, Pavel. No, Pavel, as I said in the original email, it's the 25th of October. It is November in the Gregorian calendar, but that doesn't really need to concern us because we, of course, all use the Julian calendar. Grigory Zinoviev is out of office until now. <laughs> Julian calendar? Sounds like a hairdresser. Whoops! <laughs> Oh, great. Well, if it's November the 25th, I can come for the whole thing. No hassles. Sorry, can I clarify? Is it November or October? And do we need to bring anything, Lev? Trotsky, seriously, that's not appropriate. Mikhail and Lev, it's October. October the 25th. And yes, you need to bring banners and 20 rubles. Grigory Zinoviev is out of office this morning. <laughs> and as Comrade Lennon forgot to say, guns, obviously. Forget your own head next, Vlad. Smiley face. <laughs> Guys, I don't actually have a banner. Will one be provided, or what? Yeah, and I don't have a gun, and actually I'm not massively keen on this being an armed uprising. But look, I don't want to put any noses out of joint, so maybe best if I just bow out gracefully at this stage. Best of luck, though, guys. Have a great one. Pavel, I did not forget to say guns. We're not bringing guns. This is a peaceful uprising, as agreed in committee, so there's no need for you to flounce off, Mikhail. Grigory Zinoviev is asked for this. <laughs> Flouncing, actually, comrade. And for someone who's always coming down so hard on Trotsky, I'm not sure that's very appropriate language. Coming down hard on me? Uh, I hope not. <laughs> <laughs> OK, guys, can I just say, there's obviously a bit of confusion here about the month and who's coming and are we bringing banners or guns. Can I just suggest we put it off a few months till we've got ourselves a bit better organised? Mikhail, I apologise. Of course you weren't flouncing. Trotsky, please don't. Lev, thanks for your input, really valuable, but there is no confusion, the plans have been in place for weeks. Gregory's enough, the ever since Monday. Hi guys, actually, you know, I kind of agree with Lev. Let's put a pin in this for now until we've got ourselves sorted out. After all, we want to avoid the kind of chaos we had at Tsar Nikolai's leaving, do. Best wishes. <laughs> Grigory Zinoviev. <laughs> Grigory, I thought you were out of the office. Grigory Zinoviev is out of the office. <laughs> oh, right, no, I just put that on sometime so I can get some work done. <laughs> oh, talking of Exar Nikolai, I'm having coffee with him on Wednesday. Shall I invite him along to the do? <laughs> no, Pavel, that would be massively awkward. <laughs> Grigory Zinoviev is out of office until Monday. <laughs> Oh, well, I've emailed him now, but I can cancel if you really think it would be a problem. Yes, it would. Grigory Zinoviev is out of office <laughs> Oh, OK, well, look, can you email him to explain why? I don't really know the history here. I don't want to tread on any toes. Pavel, you do know the history. You were part of the history. And Grigory, will you please take your out of office off? Grigory Zinoviev is out of office Seriously, Grigory, take it off. Seriously, Gregory, take it off. Oh, get a room, you guys. <laughs> Shut up, Trotsky! <laughs> and that's as far as we've run the simulation. But does that answer your question, madam? Uh, yes. I, I mean, it was more of an offhand comment than a serious question. But, but thank you, yes.
What was your question? How did anyone ever organise anything before email? 